11th standard volume 2 important questions for top average and slow learners so double tick means slow learners double tick single tick average students so all the questions means that is for toppers see lesson 6 gravitation 5 marks question number 1 discuss the important features of the law of gravitation to explain how Newton arrived at his law of gravitation from Kepler's third law. 3. Explain in detail the idea of weightlessness using lift as an example. 4. Explain the variation of g with altitude and depth. 5. Derive an expression for escape speed. 6. Derive the expression for gravitational potential energy. Then 3 marks. Derive an expression for energy of satellite. To explain in detail the Eratosthenes method of finding the radius of Earth. 3. Derive the time period of satellite orbiting the Earth. And 7th lesson, properties of matter, 5 marks. Question number 1. State Hooke's law and verify it with the help of an experiment. 2. What is capillarity? Obtain an expression for the surface tension of a liquid by capillary rise method. Question number 3. State and prove Bernoulli's theorem for a flow of incompressible, non-viscous and streamlined flow of fluid. Question number 4. Explain the different types of modulus of elasticity. Question number 5. Derive an expression for the total pressure at a depth h below the liquid surface. 3 marks. 1. State and prove Pascal's law in fluids or describe hydraulic lift. So this is also called as what? Force multiplier, right? Question number 2. Derive an expression for the terminal velocity of a sphere falling through a viscous liquid. 3. Describe the practical applications of Bernoulli's theorem. A. Blowing, blowing of uh, roofs during windstorm. B. Bunsen burner. Lesson 8. Heat and thermodynamics. 5 marks. Question number 1. Explain in detail Newton's law of cooling. Derive Mayer's relation for an ideal gas. Derive the work done in an adiabatic process. Explain construction of heat engine and obtain its efficiency. Question number 5. Derive the expression for Carnot engine's efficiency. Question number 6. Derive the work done in an isothermal process. Question number 7. Discuss various modes of heat transfer. 3 marks. Explain calorimetry and derive an expression for final temperature when two thermodynamic systems are mixed. Question number two. Explain in detail the working of a refrigerator. Explain zeroth law of thermodynamics. Derive the expression for the work done in a volume change in a thermodynamic system. And lesson nine. Kinetic theory of gases. Five marks. Write down the postulates of kinetic theory of gases. Question number 2. Derive the expression of pressure exerted by the gas on the walls of the container. Derive the expression for mean free path of the gas. Question number 4. Derive the ratio of two specific heat capacities of monatomic, diatomic and triatomic molecules. Question number 5. Describe the total degrees of freedom for monatomic molecule, diatomic molecule and triatomic molecule. 3 marks. 1. Explain in detail the kinetic interpretation of temperature. Question number 2. Write the expression for RMS speed, average speed and the most probable speed of a gas molecule. Question number 3. Derive the relation between pressure and mean kinetic energy. Lesson number 10. Oscillations. 5 marks. Question number 1. Discuss the symbol pendulum in detail. Question number 2. Explain in horizontal oscillations of a spring. Question number 3. Describe the vertical oscillations of a spring. Question number 4. Discuss in detail the energy in SHM. Question number 5. What is mean by angular harmonic oscillation? Compute the time period of angular harmonic oscillation. 3 marks. Question number 1. State the loss of symbol pendulum. B. Write short note on two springs connected in series. Question number 2. A. Explain resonance. Give an example. B. What is an approach? Question number 3. Why is it more difficult to revolve a stone tied to a longer string than a stone tied to a shorter string? Lesson number 11. Waves. Question number 1. 
describe newton's formula for velocity of sound waves in air and also discuss the laplace correction question number 2 what are stationary waves explain the formation of stationary waves and also write down the characteristics of stationary waves question number 3 how will you determine the velocity of sound using resonance air column apparatus question number 4 what is a sonometer give its construction and working explain how to determine the frequency of tuning for using sonometer question number 5 explain how the interference of waves is formed three marks question number 1 describe the principle and a description of a stethoscope question number 2 state the properties of progressive waves third question explain echo sonar and reverberation question number 4 write down the factors affecting velocity of sound in the gases